Man with knife stabs at least 10 on Tokyo train, starts fire. Here's a summary of the article. Tokyo, a man brandishing a knife on a Tokyo commuter train on Sunday stabbed several passengers before starting a fire, police said. NHK Public Television said at least 10 passengers were injured, including one seriously. Television footage showed a number of firefighters, police officials and paramedics rescuing the passengers, many of whom escaped through train windows. In one video, passengers were running from another car, where flames were gushing. NHK said the suspect, after stabbing passengers, poured a liquid resembling oil and set fire. Shansuke Kamura, who filmed the video, told NHK that he saw passengers desperately running and while he was trying to figure out what happened, he heard an explosive noise and saw smoke wafting. In August, the day before the Tokyo Olympics closing ceremony, a 36-year-old man stabbed 10 passengers on a commuter train in Tokyo in a random burst of violence. This post received a score of 34,000, with an upvote ratio of 94%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Greater than NHK said witnesses told police that the attacker was wearing a bright outfit, a green shirt, a blue suit and a purple coat, and looked like a comic book character or someone going to a Halloween event. Did he seriously dress up as the Joker from TDK? Almost. Is he just chilling after he stabbed 10 people? Twitter text translation. Google Translate. This guy is the criminal of the Kyo line. Knife in his right hand. Cigarette in his left hand. My hand was trembling. Anyway, I was sick of this guy. I really couldn't forgive you I wanted to hit you. Other submitted translations include, you, id zero, I think it actually says, I was so pissed I hit the window in front of him lol. I think it actually says, I was so pissed I hit the window in front of him lol. Edit. Just realized you were translating the Twitter text and not the video text. The, I hit the window, line is part of the video overlay text. I saw a video of the fire he started in one of the trains it was scary. Glad no one died. Greater than glad no one died it's a good thing Japan has strict gun laws. Video of people running away. That's scary as hell. Was that dude at like a minute and covered in blood or is it just his shirt? It's just the pattern of his shirt. It's so complicated. That's how known it's expensive. That shirt must have cost at least $400. All survived. One person is still unconscious in critical condition. Greater than Nippon Television reported that the suspect told police that he wanted to kill and get a death penalty, and that he used an earlier train stabbing case as an example. For fuck's sake, just commit suicide and stop involving other people in your desire to die. Suicide doesn't satisfy bloodlust quite like mass murder, I guess. Well and some people literally cannot bring themselves to hurt themselves, while they may be able to hurt others, but Christ if you're at that point why not find help? If you want to lose your life, it sounds like you have nothing else to lose anyways. It's not uncommon for people with mental illness to think no one can help them. I know this from experience. I was forced to get help not because I was afraid of help, but I though it wouldn't do anything. This right here. My issues are so deeply rooted in my psyche that it feels impossible to change. I don't intend on harming anyone. But if I did and that notion had the same resiliences, I know I can't fix my problems, so why try? I'd be a monster waiting to be set off like this man on the train. This whole comment has a very armchair psychologist vibe, which was unintended. Just wanted to reinforce the idea that trauma really does run deep. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.